I was unaware that there was a, you know, a whole fucking thing in my way. All right, let's let's just go. Oh shit! Woo! Hello. Oh my god, and they pop up like right in front of me. Oh my god, and there's a legendary death skull scorpion monster. Ugh. Oh god, go, 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 go. Oh, oh jeez. Woo! Woo! Um, crap. Ow. Ah! Albino? Albino? Oh god, I have no idea where I'm at. Okay, now I kinda know where I'm at. It's crazy, I forgot how scary it is. That they can just... Pop up, you know, like right where you're at. There they all are. Alright, hang in there, Hancock. Just distract them, I'm gonna launch a ton of grenades over there. Oh shit, I fucked that grenade up. See, I got that one. <laughs> Look at him go. Woo! <laughs> Just flying over there. Ugh. Oh, you bastard. Ugh. No idea where the other scorpion is, though. Oh, shit. He's behind me. Ah. Uh. Ah, no stars. Alright. Ooh, I can light his face up, though. He's like, ow! Mutated. Ah! Run! Jeez. Ah, 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 ah! Oh, God. Ah, fuck. One underground. Yeah. Pops up right behind me. Shit, dude. Alright. I think I outsmarted him. <laughs> oh, I can't hit him now. Alright, come on, dude. Where you at? Where you at? Needs me to walk out here. Oh man, did it just disappear? Cause I'm totally cool with that. Let's we'll get Hancock up and we can mosey on along our Oh god. Ah. Uh. Yes. Can stun him. Oh, mysterious stranger! He's like, I got you. Cool. <laughs> wow. Man, that was an intense fight. Cloaking combat armor, left leg. Interesting. I'll have to check that out later as well. Oh man, that was intense. All right, well let's continue through that hallway then. I guess. Wow. It was nuts was nuts. <laughs> Shit. And there's still some more of these fuckers. Just these guys are regular. Regular ass rad scorpions. There's nothing special going on here with these guys. Uh. In fact, that one got the fuck out of it. He was like, oh god! Maybe he had to refigure out his strategy. There we go. Nice. Um, so I gotta clear this out. Oh, we're back to the northeast sector. Where I saw that sign. People won, beds won, happiness is going up. I guess that's good.
remove that <laughs> that support beam or whatever the hell that was. All right, let's clear that rock slide. There we go. That's gonna be nice. Jeez, this place is huge. Oh, we're back to the, uh, the entrance here. Okay. So that would be to go talk to the uh, the guys, the 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 vault dwellers, the new vault dwellers, or whatever. Okay, let's clear out the east sector. Okay, apparently we cannot clear out that one. But we can clear out this one. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to get the one on the ground. Oh, God. There were, there were three of them. Charred, Gangrious... Ho ho! Whoa! I'm not about to die. Ah, uh, yeah, I gotta use the the psycho buff. Need that extra XP. I'm getting wrecked right now. Oh, why did I waste it on that then? Damn, I should have used my critical on the other the other ghoul. Get him, Hancock. Man, I got a little scared there for a second. I'm not even going to lie. I was like, woo! Control board. Nice. Nice. Does that mean I got to clear that out now? I go all the way back up to the workshop? Or do I go over here? Oh, I can just go over here. Would you look at that? Shit. Mirelurks. I hate Mirelurks, man. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Why are these guys, like, flipping all over the place and shit now? I kind of love it, though. I'm not going to lie. I think it's hilarious. I guess my laser rifle to kind of tears these guys up pretty good. So they're not too bad. But man, oh, man. Let me put that control board in. Oh, there's a Meyer Lurk Queen. Woo! I forgot about her. Shit. All right. Cryogenic grenade. Let's see how this goes. I just threw it in her face. It bounced off. Is that the grenade that did that much? Oh, yeah. The grenade doesn't do a whole lot. Ah. Damn, I, I keep trying to, like, back up, and I'm running into shit. Oh, my God! Oh, yeah, nice. Uh, sit down. She's a big un. She's dead. She has a laser rifle. What were you thinking, girl? Run around with a laser rifle. You're a Meyer Lurk. Meyer Lurks don't use laser rifles. Idiot. Alright. Is there anything over here that I can clear out? Limestone wall. Would you look at that? Leading to this area? Where is this? This is just all more of the east sector. Oh, yeah, we're back up here. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Could I clear out this wall all the way up here? Oh, yeah, I already did. <laughs> That's right. Let's see, we're back to square one. Okay, so we got one more. Looks like we got one more wall to clear out. We'll go meet the new uh, vault dweller candidates, and I think we'll call it an episode. Probably going to be a two-parter because it's so damn long. But it'll all work out in the end. I'll get two parts out of this whole recording. Duck tape. So we've already been here. Oh, okay. We'll go to this uh, marker over here. 77 and stuff. 
Yeah, just head over here. Down here into the depths. I don't have a whole lot of ammo left for that. I'm a little worried about it. Alright, so we're coming over here. Did I just like completely skip over this last time? Or I thought we were over here. There's a... There's the control board. Oh, the control board's right here. I walked right past it. Wow. The north sector. Vault trunk. There's nothing in it. What a letdown. The trunk looked fancy. I thought it was going to be something good. Ooh, ouch. Hey, that did a little bit of damage, sir. Man, I don't hurt him worth a damn. It's okay, though. We got him. A little combo there. Your boy Hancock and, you know, and Brian, ultimate crew. Shit. There we go. I meant to use the rat away first. Hey, hey, what you got? Hey, I got to trade you some items really quick. Oh, you got 216 rounds? You're doing pretty good. Let me get these. You can keep your rounds. Let me get that vacuum tube. I don't know why you have those. Uh, here's 99 more. There you go. You're welcome. What am I at? 101? All right, I'm cool with that. That'll get me through this little vault area. And after this, I'm gonna drop off. Uh, I'm gonna drop Hancock off. At the Red Rocket truck stop, because we're gonna do a little bit of experimenting on the vault dwellers, and depending on what you do, you could score points or lose points with your companions. And I already got his perk. I don't know if you can lose perks once you get them, but I don't wanna find out, so I'm just gonna keep him with me until so we're almost done unlock all vault 88 build areas and we completed the quest explore vault 88 so look at that i need to get back to the uh area and i feel like i'm taking a very long route but that's okay That is okay. Oh yeah, Rad Scorpionsville over here. Fuck. I'm just trying to get back to where it all began. There we go, it's up these stairs. I believe. Yeah, it's up these stairs and then we'll be back in the main room. We can go meet our new guests. Ah! What the fuck just happened there? Whoa! Is there a little hole you can like, yeah. <laughs> I just turned a little wide and went right through that little gap there. It's fine though. This game does have tight ass controls for the most part. Even the jumping's so much better compared to it was in like Morrowind and Oblivion. It's pretty good in Skyrim too. Woo! <laughs> just having fun with it. Alright, let's go over here. I wonder where Hancock is. Oh, he's right behind me. He's doing a good job at following me. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. If you could all just wait over there. A ghoul? Yeah. Uh, I don't know about that. A ghoul? <laughs> I can't be associated with a ghoul. Hey. Just a moment and we can begin. I'm an awful person. Please, step forward. Ah, yes. Welcome. Ah, Welcome. yes. <laughs> so, this here is a vault, right? Quite correct. And you could be one of our lucky new residents. You do got food, Ooh. right? Of course. And a chance at a new life. A question or two first, however. What do you think is the role of a good government? Government? What the hell are you talking about? Hey, we're the good guys. It's all right. We're the good guys. Just answer the questions. Hmm, you seem... All right. Okay. <laughs> From what I heard, them governments are why everything's radioactive. You won't do for our special assignment. But welcome to our vault. Your new home. If she is representative of what's left above. The outside world must be 
rougher than I imagined. Are you yeah, it's pretty rough. Interview? Where'd she go? Oh, she just heads that way. Why didn't she work as a test subject? Skeptics and cynics rarely produce good data. No, we need someone willing to cooperate. Let's continue. Well, let's continue. All right. Hello. Welcome to Vault 88. This is a real nice place you have here. Real nice. And I can go wherever I like, right? Within reason, yes. But I have a question for you. Sure, sure. What do you want to know? A hypothetical. Let's say the reactor core is melting down, and you're the only one who could stop it. Is there something wrong with your reactor? No, no, it's fine. Just pretend, so you can stop the meltdown. But you'd suffer from extreme radiation exposure. What would you do? Well, whatever you'd like. If you don't mind, I'm anxious to look around. Don't rip us off. Why are you here? Just come here to lend a hand, right? I want to do whatever it takes to help out. If you're thinking about <laughs> ripping us off, don't. Listen, it's hell up there. If you really get a place to stay. I'll be good. Just don't go expecting me to jump in a reactor for you. I think we could use them in our vault. As long as you guys are on the level, I'll give this thing a try. Honest. I appreciate your candor. You can stay, but you're not what we're looking for. Go ahead and get acquainted with your new home. What a All right. powerful gentleman. <laughs> Clearly, he won't work for our experiments. Here's hoping third time's a charm. Just for clarification, what's specifically wrong with him? An obvious liar would invalidate any subjective responses we need from a test subject. No, he just wouldn't do at all. All right, well, next interview. As you say, hello. <laughs> Welcome to your new home. Wow. A real overseer. I, I am so happy to be here. Hi. My name is Clem. Uh, yes. Clem, is it? Before you settle in, I have some questions. Oh, okay. Uh, sure. I, I'll answer anything you like. Well, uh, that's good. Here's a scenario. You've been assigned guard duty. You know, stand watch and make sure outsiders don't breach the perimeter. But from inside the vault, you hear a woman screaming. What would you do? You want me to guard something? Sure. Uh, I can do that. I can do that right now, if you want. But I don't hear any screaming, lady overseer. <laughs> uh would you help the lady or not? Yeah, sorry. Well, if you tell me to guard, I guard, and I won't leave my post unless you tell me to. Is is that okay? Another question for you. What can you tell me about your mother? Oh, she passed. But she was nice. You would have liked her. She called she killed a mole rat once. Really? Uh, that's remarkable. <laughs> Describe the traits you most admire about her. Well, she was strong because of the mole rat. And she, uh, uh, she, she fed me. God, I I'm sorry. Th this place is so much better than the ditch I was living in. Surely there are other traits you liked about her. Well, no matter how bad things got, she put us kids first. She fought until the end, too. We're looking for a volunteer, Clem. Someone to test some new devices that will help everyone. 
Are you interested? You mean I can stay? I, 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 I mean, yes. I'll help out. I like helping. That's me, Clem. Always willing to help out. Yes. <sighs> I think you'll do nicely. And no time like the present to commence. Now that we have, um, Clem, we are ready to begin. The first step is to get him properly equipped and dressed. There should be supplies in the welcome area near the entrance. Power to the people. Outfit Clem in a vault suit. And we completed a model citizen. Oh yeah! Look at that. I think this is the, uh... What is this? Oh. Yeah, you can... Actually, I think I'm gonna put this... Is this what I want? I don't know, I think you get a better... Better jumpsuit after completing everything. Okay, well that finishes off that quest, so now we only have the power to the people. So why don't we go ahead and clear out a side area really quick, since we have time. I'm going to have to split this up into two videos anyway, so I might as well make them, you know, roughly a half hour each. Keep this progress going. So let's leave the Commonwealth, or not leave the Commonwealth, head to the Commonwealth, leave Vault 88. Actually, I probably, can you fast travel? I think you can fast travel from within Vault 88. I don't know what I was thinking. But we're going to head to the South Boston Military Checkpoint. And over there is a magazine. That's what we're going to be snagging while we're there. Uh, i got to figure out where we want to get to there from. Probably. Hmm. Go back to the world map. Let's see. It's like, it's like over here. This little area over here. I don't know which way I want to head there from. Well, let's head there from University Point. How's that sound? <laughs> I don't know if you guys know. <laughs> You're just like, oh, I guess it sounds good. You're the one showing us, motherfucker. <laughs> You're the one making this walkthrough. I don't know if it's good. Well, I hope so. It's going to be a good time. I need to get something to eat. I'm getting hungry. Hungry mungry. I'm trying to finish off this Vault 88 or Vault Tech Workshop quest line though. Cause I, I just finished uh uploading the last not the last two acts, but uh I, I uploaded two acts of Gears of War, so now I need to break that up with some Fallout 4, and I figured I'd do the whole Vault Tech workshop quest line and it's gonna be like, you know, three or four episodes long. And what have you. Alright, so it's gonna be the circle y thing on the map with the star in it. That's the South Boston military checkpoint. I'm gonna kill these raiders since we're here. I like, oh, might as well fuck with these dudes. Get some shotgun shells too, so that's good. And a Molotov. Ooh. Explosives box. Get him, Hancock. Hancock's like, dude, why are you p opening up boxes? We gotta fight. I'm like, doo 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 doo. Hate people that do that in like D and D campaigns and stuff, and even just like multiplayer games. Like ball, like Gauntlet. Dark Legacy, there'd be someone who always just ran. This kid was a turd. This is uh, when I was growing up, too. So this is a little while ago. This is probably like 15 years ago for me or something like that. I was like, I don't know. It's kind of younger. But he would always go for the fucking treasure boxes and stuff while we're trying to fight away, you know, the hordes of monsters that are approaching. Just didn't give a shit whatsoever, but that's fine, because, you know, fuck him. Whatever. He was a turd, I don't... Last time I heard, he was not doing so well in life, which, I mean, is kind of unfortunate. I don't want to... I don't wish he was dead or anything, but hopefully he got his comeuppance for being such a turd. Uh, current orders. Department of the Army, Echo Company, 104th Infantry Regiment. Memorandum for record. Subject, search and seizure procedure. Search and seizure procedure. Effective 1st of August, 2077. All vehicles traveling through designated checkpoint must submit a full stop and inspection. 
Inspections may include the stripping and deconstruction of suspicious vehicles. Citizens are to wait inside the designated areas until inspection, avoiding communication at all times. At no time will they be allowed to tamper with the vehicle until an inspection has ended. Magazines and other approved periodicals may be available during the waiting period. A civilian may leave once the inspection is passed. Should an inspection result in an operable vehicle, the vehicle and or all parts will be shipped to the civilians within 10, 15 business days. Wait, what? So, wow. Soldiers are instructed to refer these civilians to a list of taxi services available in your area. Upon the detection of any contraband, as listed in the field manual, please contact military police immediately and detain vehicles passengers until arrival. Means of detainment are subject to the discretion of the highest ranking officer on site. Log entries. Jones family. Subject, ex-military, U.S. Marine, cooperation, search yielded nothing of note, personal luggage, and one musical instrument, trombone. Contents of vehicle match the subject's story. Donald Bajinski or something? Buksinski? I don't know. Subject reported as church pastor. Attire match story. Inspector found no need for further interrogation. Subject was cleared. Uh, Deering and Kennedy. Deering, Keith and Kennedy Collin. What? Oh, Keith Deering and Kennedy Colin, or Colin Kennedy. I see. Search with minor incident. Trunk of vehicle contained miscellaneous camera equipment and general tools. Subjects briefly detained and questions. Produced all proper permits for filming within city, city limits. Incident filed with HQ. Subjects allowed passage. Wu family. Michael and Jennifer Wu and their son George. Detained. Subjects displayed suspicious behavior, resulting in a full inspection, including dismantling the vehicle, despite a lack of contraband, and a full apology from the inspection lead. The subjects began acting aggressively, including yelling at soldiers in a foreign language, most likely Chinese. Subjects were detained, and military police was contacted in accordance with the field manual. Cool. Detainment network offline. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Why do I keep doing that? Kept hitting A like immediately after. That was weird. Okay. So uh there's just a little little building over here that we're gonna go into. Nothing crazy. We take out these gunners, they seem to be inhabiting the area. Ooh. Ooh. Uh eat it. Get him, Hancock. Yeah. Pretty easy commander, if that is your real rank. Oh, jeez. There's a legendary one. How? Just punched me back. He was like, you motherfucker. Powered metal chest piece. Oh, that's weak. Weak. I like the fusion cell and the stim pack, though. I will take those. Cool beans. Is that it? Just those three guys. Oh yeah, there's a suit of power armor over here. It's pretty powerful. Uh, you can just hack this terminal, I guess, to get it. Resembles. Summoning. Oh, five, wow. It's gotta be stumbling, yeah. Not for you, but at least for my file. I was like, man, it's gotta be stumbling. I can just... I can smell it. I can open this bad boy, get some XO1 or whatever. I'll take this fusion core. I think I'm going to just leave this here. I think my power armor is better. The one that I have at my home base of Sanctuary. The home base that everyone has. Oh, shit! Woo! I saw a little explosion symbol. And I was like, man, oh man. That would have sucked if it just exploded when I walked over there. That guy flew over there. We got ourselves a little tank behind it. Alright, let's uh, get the magazine in here and stop bullshitting and end the episode. How does that sound? And then we can get on to the next the next Vault Tech quest. I think it's the last one, actually. We'll probably finish it. Uh, but I'm going to drop off Hancock at the little at the uh, little companion place. I don't think I'm going to bring another companion along. Here's the magazine. Ballistic weapons. Oh yeah, it's a guns and bullets. So if you use guns... Like regular guns, unlike me, then you got a little boost. Good for you. Dog tags. Dog tags. Yo, that dog tag. Master lock. 
Uh, I'm gonna see if this computer can open it. Pulse grenade. I don't need any of that shit. Also, I leveled up. I just realized that. These are all the same, yeah, so it's all the same shit as the other one. I guess not. I guess I have to pick it, which is fine. Ooh. Nice. Woo! I don't know what I'll need silver for, but I'll take this and... What is going on out here? I heard some gunfire, and why the fuck is it so bright? Where's all this fighting going on at? I wonder if it's over there. At the, uh, this little salvage area. I'm not sure. We're not going to get into it, though. Uh, let me go ahead and level up the next demolition level, and then I think I'm going to end the episode here. And we'll go ahead and can... I don't know if we're going to complete it. But we will do the next vault uh, quest next episode and probably explore this area that we're looking at over there behind the South Boston military checkpoint. So I'm going to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like. Consider subscribe to the channel, you know, if you enjoy it. My name is Brian, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.